hello friends today in this tutorial i will be telling you that uh, how to get the youtube video id from the complete url so many a times if you are developing applications you will need the youtube video id let me just show you what is uh, meant by youtube video id so basically let me take the example of my video here any video the video id typically is this id you can see that this is a portion that signifies the video id so we will be extracting this portion you can take any example of any youtube video so this is a portion here so we can extract this portion inside python programmatically we will not be using any third party library for this let me show you the demo let me run the application so enter the youtube video url so basically it's a command line application here you need to copy paste the complete video url that you want to extract copy it and paste it here and now if you enter it it will exactly tell you the video id is this so it has extracted this portion and it is displaying it on the command line this is that simple application so many a times when you're developing applications you will need google video id you can take any video just copy link address paste it you can see that so all the source code regarding this python script guys i have uh, written a complete blog post so if you want to get all the source code you can go to the video description link to download all the source code this is a python script here simply copy to clipboard I will be writing uh, this python script from scratch so if you are watching it for the very first time then please hit the like button subscribe the channel as well so just open your text editor just open uh, visual studio or any text editor just make a app.py or any uh, uh, name of a file here so we will define a custom function guys which will be vid video underscore id and this will be expecting a url parameter which will be passed when we invoke this function so here inside this function we need to uh, import a module here which is url lib dot parse and from this we need to import a url parse comma parse underscore qs this is the stuff that you need to import after that guys you need to check in the if condition that uh, if url starts with this pattern which is youtube and www in both the scenarios you need to append http to it at the starting so basically it is meant by this if uh, it is starting the url if uh, let's suppose the url is starting like this or like this so in both the scenarios you need to append http to it so in order to be a valid url you need to be assigning http in both the scenarios after this we can query url pass and pass the url 
and after that we can check if youtube in theory dot host name if you youtube is present inside the host name then we obviously know that it's a valid url and then basically we can extract the portion that we want which is video id after the slash watch section after the question mark we need to return parse underscore qs and here we will say query dot query and the portion that we want is v and after that zero so as you can see here this is the portion that we need to get v is equal to after this this is a video id portion so we need to simply extract this so this is the logic for this so this will extract this and now we will also write a else if condition else if query dot path starts with embed url it can also be a embed url if you want to embed your url in that scenario we will have slash v slash in that case we need to return query dot path dot split slash two and last else if guys this is for this one the outer if condition if uh, the you if the url is if this is present inside the url in query host name then we need to simply return query dot path one colon so now we need to write the else condition for the outer if else we can raise value error so this typically means that we are not passing a error so it will raise a exception so now we can get the url from the user by using input method so here we can simply say enter the youtube video url after that we can pass uh, call this function which is video underscore id print it the video id is so now if i execute this python script python url dot py so if i don't provide the url it will raise this exception you can see that if i does provide the url so you can see the video id is this so in this way guys you can build out with a very simple application inside python which extract the video id of youtube from the complete url so if you like this video then please hit the like button subscribe the channel as well and i will be seeing you in the next live stream